here is how you put CapCut onto your Stream Deck. So right here is what it actually looks like on my Stream Deck. So if I come in and I press this button right here, cool, and I have my options here, and then I'm going to press this button to actually launch the app. Okay, cool, here is what I have. Here are two ways to actually do this. So let's jump right in. Here is option one on how to do it. So for me, what I actually do, because of course, if you just have your launch app that over here, you can do that, but I would put it in a folder of some sort, right? Because I use this and I use all of my options inside of this folder. So. I did go in and kind of was like, okay, these do not work, but this one and this one do work. So for this right here to actually launch it, right? Cool. Works. Here is what you have to do. So you're going to do it from your actual stream deck. So if you look down here, it is system open. So if we come over here to the right side, it's going to be this Part right here let me just get this obs out of the way so it's system right here so you're gonna click that and it's going to drop down and you have this open key so all you're gonna do is drag it into where you actually want it so you're gonna drag it into there okay cool and then from there you're going to select the file on where it is on the actual stream deck option so you're not going to do this first one this is a select a folder it's going to be select a file okay cool and then you have all your options right here so what i actually do is i'm going to go into my desktop right here and then i have all my options here i'm going to come down to cap cut this is a shortcut so from here, you're going to press that and you're going to go to open. And now you have this link right here on the bottom. And then after that, you will have this option here, which is legit. So let me click off of that and I'm going to test it out. Cool. I just press this button and you are good to go on that one. You do have options to, you know, like cap cut one or you know you, you you can do stuff with all that all right and then option two is this option right here so it's the exact same thing right here you're going to go over to system you're going to come over here to open cool and then from there what you're going to do is you're going to go over to where you have it on your actual com computer here and then you're going to right click on it and then you're going to go to copy as path right so it's copied and then you're going to come back over here and then you're going to put it in here so i'm gonna have it clicked i'm gonna right click and then i'm going to go to paste right and then from there of course you would do cap cut or you know all that extra stuff there it won't actually show you know this the up on the screen for some odd reason so we have that option all right so after all said and done you want to make sure it works so i'm just gonna go the off of it and i'm going to click it and then you are good to go so here is how you actually get this this shortcut onto your actual computer all right so let me come out of this you're, you're going to come into your start menu and then it should be already on your computer, of course. So you're going to go to cap cut and then we're, we're going to go to open file location. Cool. This is what it gave me right here. And then what I'm going to do, I'm just going to have it and I'm just going to drag it on to your computer. So that right there is an easy way. It won't do it right now because I already have one at the bottom and I'm just going to go to skip this file. Right. And then of course it should work. Here is how you make a folder for CapCut to hold all of your stuff. So what you're going to do is 
go up to this second option right here on the top right. And then you're going to go to create folder. So you're just going to highlight it and you're going to drag it in. And then it should have this icon right here. And then of course you can just name it cap cut and all that stuff all up to you. And then from there, it's cool because you could go in and then it's it's empty. And then from there, you would just add in your certain things you want to do, like control, split all, copy and all of that stuff. So like again, so you're going to come in here. Here is where you would add in how to launch that one. Right. So again, let's come up here to system. And then you're going to go to open, right? And then you would do all of the options. How I was saying, you can do that option or you could bring it straight from there, right? You're going to do that option there and then you're going to add it into there. So you can have something of this sort as you are in cap cut, right? You have your pointer split, delete all up to you and i will put a link down below if you want to get some of these special options you could use to make your stream deck look cool and again i made a, a video on how i set it up for cap cut and then as well as browsing the internet on your computer so like subscribe and have a great rest of your day